All right, what's going on? It's Bobby Skinner, Jam Football, doing a draft matchup breakdown of Oregon State offensive tackle Talisi Fuaga and then UCLA edge uh, Light to Law to. These both both these guys are going to be first rounders, probably in the top half of the first round, and I think you can argue for each of them at being the best at their position. But this was a fun matchup. I you know I I think Fuaga uh, ended up winning it, but let's go into it. There's seven plays, so not a ton. Uh, but this was a lot of fun, and you know, two guys essentially playing chess against each other. And these these offensive tackle edge rusher matchups are fun to watch. Make sure to like and subscribe to the channel. All that good stuff. Uh, we already have a law two breakdown out. We'll have a Fuaga uh, breakdown out. You know, in the coming couple of weeks. So let's get into it. First play, we got a pass play. Obviously, right tackle Fuaga, and then the edge law two. Fuaga does a great job of getting to his landmarks on this. So we'll start from his point of view, right? So let's watch his sheet. One, two, three, right? So we get to that third step with, uh, you know, we, our hips aren't open. We're not, you know, forcing him around the corner. But Law 2 counters well with this, right? Like, okay, he's gotten to his landmarks. I'm not getting around the corner at this, right? He's too athletic to do that. And, you know, he's too strong. I'm, I'm going to have to work inside. So law two counters, right? He wants to counter inside, stepping off that left foot, go, good, right? But Fuaga is able to shut it down because Fuaga, watch his left foot, right? It drops back a little bit, but it's it's almost horizontal, right? We're on, we're all, our feet are essentially horizontal at this point instead of dropping the foot back a yard or two and then giving a path for uh, law two to the quarterback, and. Lands this this left hand well, right? And for, and Latu's not able to break those hands off of him. Fuaga keeps his feet moving. No foot crossover. Really good rep for Fuaga. Next rep on a quick throw. Some good and bad from both of these guys. Fuaga, we'll look at these feet again. One, two. On the third step, we open up our hip. Right, we're reading. He's working around the corner. Not the worst thing in the world. But Law Two, he's going to attack those hands. Right, he has good footwork. He gives this little stutter, and then when Fuaga has this right hand out here, well, Law Two's going to work that chop, that cross chop. Right, works the cross chop. So gets this hand down, attacks the back, and then now he's around the corner. Shows pretty good dip. Now the ball's out. It's a quick throw, so Fuaga may be giving him the corner. But from Fuaga's point of view, right, we're we're good right here, right? Be patient with your hands because Law Two is so much of, of what he does is in his hand uh, hand fight, but he doesn't have long arms. Be patient, right? And something he could do is like throw this hand out here, bait him into this move, and then pull it. Because if he reloads this, you know, this hand right here, and then lands it again, well, he's got the athleticism, the feet to move around. And you still see he's got good athleticism to you know wash him around the back of the pocket, but it is a it is a you know a, a three step drop for the quarterback. Next play, this Fuaga is just going to absorb. Kind of an inconsequential play. Ball comes out quick, just quick feet from Fuaga. Bam, bam, bam. Right, patient, not oversetting. Law is going to go try and work power, work inside. Fuaga absorbs it. You can't see it, but his hands are inside. Absorbs that power. Nice ref for Fuaga. Here is the is the stuff that wouldn't get you hyped about Fuaga and a little worried about Law 2. It's in the run game. I mean, this is an ass kicking right here. Fuaga's working this drop step. You see how quickly he's able to close this space? And then watch the power go from the left leg up through his left arm and just pin him out. Pin him out, right? Like a bouncer throwing someone at the club. Bam, right? Pin him out. Rework this hand. Break this hand off of you and just keep moving. Keep your feet moving through, con through, you know, through first contact. Just one, two, three. Bam. And keep the feet moving. And then... Law 2, I know he's not the biggest guy, not the strongest guy. You've got to be able to get hands on guys and drop your ass. And and just at least, never going to be a great edge setter. But you can't get forced out like this. And you're going to see it in another run play where it's a double team. Next play. 
you know, ball gets out. But this is a good hand fight by uh, Law 2. Fuaga, one, two, three. Good footwork. But again, Law 2 is going to attack those hands. So Law 2 attacks his inside shoulder. He's not getting around the corner. Attacks his inside shoulder. And then from Fuega's point of view, don't try and take this hand, put it inside, and then just whip it out. Whip it out. Break that arm off you. And that's, that's going to allow you to get your hands in his chest too. And this is over. But instead, because Fuego's trying to lift this hand up off of him, it gives something for Law 2 to attack. So you're going to see Law 2. He's going to swipe that hand, get lateral. Now he's got the guard help there, but I think that's a you know a pretty decent rep for Law 2 and ends up being touchdown Oregon State. Here another play in the run game. This is the double team, but for Law 2, you just can't get your ass kicked like this, man. So good drop step, bucket step for Fuega. Gets into the contact. Right, this is a double team, but this is this is being initiated by Fuaga. All right, just keeps his feet moving for Law Two. Man, you got to see this double, and you got to you got to sink. You got to you got to anchor down and sink. Instead, Fuaga is able to get that momentum going, and the tight end is there for the ride. And at this point, we're just we're just ass kicking. Right, we're standing straight up. We're just moving you. We're, tr we're proving a point at that. And then the last play we're going to do. Pass play. Fuego gives that outside arm. Has, has guard help here. Good footwork by Fuaga. Which is a little over eager with that punch. Right? See how we're lunging a bit. Not crazy, but we are lunging a bit. But you also give those hands for Law to, to attack. And you see how he chops with this left hand. And then is able to swat the uh, with his right hand versus Fuaga's left. And work lateral because Law 2 works very, lateral very well. And all in one moment and then rip through. Now, you could you would say, you would look at this and just say it's holding. I don't know if it's the same as college as it is in the NFL. When the pass rushers work, work this rip move inside... The tackles are allowed to hold. It's a bizarre rule. I only learned it a couple years ago. But that is holding. But good power by Law 2, right? Who's, again, not the most powerful guy in the world. But to keep the feet driving, you know, and you get this guard help, to at least get a hit on this quarterback, right? You get Fuaga on his ass. Like, good power by Law 2. Ends up being a touchdown for Oregon State. But uh, but some good stuff from, from Law 2. So, overall, I think Fuaga ends up winning this matchup. Uh, and to me, looked like a better just prospect. And it got me excited about Fuaga, and I'm excited to do the individual breakdown on him. For Law 2, you see the things he does well, but you also see some things where, hey, he can do this well. But at the NFL, um, it may be a, a much bigger challenge where tackles are not using their hands as much, you know, to, to give you less to attack as a pass rusher. And he may not have that, you know, that power to consistently win. And then in the run game, you know, a, a little more worrisome for Law 2. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Like and subscribe to the channel. Going to try and get some more matchup breakdowns out. Not a ton this year to pull from. Uh, but let me know if there's some good, you know, offensive line, defensive line matchups that you guys want to see. And I'll try and get to it. Appreciate you guys. See you on the next one.